Hey guys, this is Mr. Crayfish and welcome back. In this video today, I'm going to be showing you guys a quick and simple mod I have created. Now, while I was updating the furniture mod to 1.8, on that note, it's not out yet either. Um, it's still <laughs> to be published. But while I was updating it, um, I actually discovered that Minecraft has an inbuilt lock system. And what this basically means is that you can put a password on a block and it basically... Um, you can only open it if you have an item with that name on it So what I've decided to do is actually to create a mod to utilize that feature because Basically the only way you could do it in vanilla minecraft is through commands and it's you couldn't do it in survival at all But basically this mod allows you to actually utilize it and actually be able to use it in survival mode So let's get into it. The first thing that we're going to need to do is craft a key so to craft a key we simply need a gold ingot and then you need to put two nuggets on the side like that and we get a key. Now you can't use this straight away because uh, what I've decided to do is to make it so you have to rename it because if you left it as just the default um, it's a high chance that someone could actually uh, get into your chest or whatever you're trying to keep locked. So you have to go ahead and get an anvil and you want to rename your key, so let's just rename mine to cheese. So basically the name of the item is the password, so let's go ahead and what we're going to do is we're going to get out these blocks here. So in vanilla, these blocks here have the lockable um, feature on them, so hopper, a furnace, dispenser, chest, brewing stand and the beacon, they all have the lock function on them. So let's go ahead and we're going to place the hopper down and as you can see I can access this normally but if I go ahead and I right click the hopper with the key you'll see that it says successfully locked the block with the key cheese now if I try to open this without using the key well without having the key in my hand it's going to pop up with this message here this block is locked with a key so if I go ahead and right click this now with our key here you'll see that it now opens so this is possible for again I've already mentioned furnace dispenser chest brewing stand and beacon so let's go ahead and lock them all with the key cheese now let's just test we can't get into any of them but if we right click them with the key we can actually get inside of it now one thing you might be asking what if someone tries to um, use a key with the invalid password well it's going to give them this this message here this key does not fit the lock now in the upcoming update to my furniture mod I've decided to utilize this locking feature so if you actually have the furniture mod and this key mod installed you can actually lock some of the furniture in my mod so the ones that you can lock is the cabinet bedside cabinet kitchen cabinet wall cabinet fridge oven dishwasher and washing machine. So let's go ahead and let's place these down. So we've got the cabinet, bedside cabinet, blah blah blah. Oops. Fridge, oven, dishwasher, and the washing machine. So let's go ahead and let's test all these out. So as you can see, we can get into them. But if we go ahead and we right click them with the with the key, we're gonna lock them with the password cheese. Now we've locked all the blocks with the password cheese, um, so as you can see, we can't get into any of the uh, GUIs here. But if we right click them with the key, as you can see, we can uh, get inside. And a little bit of spoilers. <laughs> but yeah, this is a very simple mod, and if you want to go ahead and download it, the link will be in the description. If you're unsure of the name of the mod, it is Mr. Crayfish's Key Mod. I should have probably mentioned that at the start of the video. But anyway, that's going to be it. I've got another uh, furniture mod update video coming really soon. I just really wanted to uh, create a video quickly on this mod because um, it is now on my website. You can go ahead and download it. Link is in the description. But anyway, I'll see you guys later and more videos will be coming because I'm on holidays right now, which is really awesome. So, <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to leave a like and I'll see you guys later. Bye.